That's right, ladies and gentlemen. We had our first Cybertruck sighting. It was such a big thing. People was just pulling out their damn camcorders, recording it as it rolled by. And we later find out that it was Elon Musk rolling up to that Malibu restaurant, Nambu, where all the stars go in. And catch this. At that restaurant, most of the time, you're supposed to let the valet park your car. And what did y'all think Elon said to that? Elon said, hell to the no, you're not parking the cyber truck. And then when he left, he whips out of there, runs over the little thing on the road in true Elon form. The truck is huge. But this video is to talk about when you see Elon, you need to invest and why getting some Tesla stock right now is a great choice. If you're finding me for the first time, please subscribe to the channel. Join me on all my social media links. I do have a Facebook group that talks about EVs that you can join, link is in description. And if you enjoy buying YouTuber merch, please go check out shoplifegames.com. Elon is a, I don't wanna say an evil genius, but he is a genius. And when he went out there over this weekend with that truck, it got a lot of the people who are investors talking. It even got this lady named Kathy Woods talking who normally doesn't have nice things to say about Tesla. Hell, a lot of people don't have a, not, a lot of nice things to say about Tesla because the company hadn't made money. But check out what she said on CNBC. Tesla investor sees, worst case, a stock double by 2024 saying she has numbers to back it up. And ladies and gentlemen, not only does she has numbers, I've got some too that I'm gonna show y'all. She runs a company called Art, and she said that by 2024, the stock of Tesla should double, completely double. And ladies and gentlemen, there are so many things fueling the thought process behind that. Why would their stocks double? What has been the, the signs that say that other than Elon Musk getting out in a cyber truck. And by the end of this video, you'll see how all these things connect. So let's go back to the kind of growth Tesla has seen over the last couple of years. So in 2016 versus 2015, they saw a 50% growth increase. Then in 2017, they saw a 33% growth increase of cars delivered. 2018, 142% increase. And right here in quarter 2019, thanks in part to that grand car called a Model 3 that I bought in September, they saw a 47% increase in their year over year numbers in car sales. All that gives rise to why people are starting to feel better about where Tesla's going with their stock. But the other tidbit that you have to plug into this whole entire thing is that Tesla currently is only has 17% of the global market share in EV sold. And with this huge growth, you can see a lot of good things coming forward. But one big thing that Elon is the master of doing that they spend no money on, that all the other car manufacturers spend money on, ladies and gentlemen, is advertising. And with Elon Musk being the king of trolling and the king of marketing, that creates a community and it creates an opportunity for free advertising. Take a look at this. The average other car dealers, when you add them all up, they spend $861 per unit of car sold. That's a huge chunk of money. That is money that could be in a stock portfolio doing something else. You could be taking a trip with your honey, or if you got multiple honeys, you could be doing something else with that money. But because Tesla pays no money for marketing, they're not spending anything extra on a unit. So they just sitting back banking all of that. Elon even himself came out and said, word of mouth is more of a driving factor in the demand and excess of a great product. Eventually, we might have some plans to do advertising, but right now, why would Elon do that, ladies and gentlemen? Because when he comes out and makes these grand statements like what he did with this truck popping out in Malibu, it gets buzz, it gets people talking, it builds a community. 
By building a community, Elon has been able to get people like me and other YouTubers to create videos that talk about the greatness of the car. And at the end of the day, if the product is good, which the car is, it winds up selling itself because more people want to get into the community and tell other people about the product. And the other thing that's helping to fuel this speculation that this stock is going to be really, really good is that Elon is not even done unveiling other products. He's still got the Cybertruck that's got to come out. He's got the new Roadsters that's got to come out. And he's got that semi truck that's going to be out there rolling around, probably going to everybody who has a truck delivering freight. That's going to get sold too. So ladies and gentlemen, him being out is a microcosm of why this company is headed in the right direction and why you should go out there and get yourself some stock. And you should also go out there and get yourself a Tesla. Saves you money. It'll make you money if you get the stock and you become a part of a great community that some are saying is cult-like in terms of the Apple community. That's gonna do it for this video. Don't forget to like my video. Please comment, subscribe, go get yourself a life game. What do you think Tesla stock is gonna do? Are you some of those haters out there that still want to, don't wanna believe in this Tesla movement? Cause I ain't. I'm in the Tesla bandwagon all day. I'm driving the Tesla. I might even be getting that cyber truck. Leave me your comments. And until the next sexy as hell Tesla video, I'll see you.